Hello everyone, welcome back. Today we're back here on Pokemon Scarlet, and the Indigo Disc DLC has been released, and I am now just going to try it out. I have my second character, but I have not tried it. This is going to be my first reactions. And I have not, I've tried to stay away from anything that's going to happen. So we'll, we'll see how this works. But I do know that all the legendaries are going to be catchable. So that's nice. And we are just here where we left off with the teal mask. I have not gone and got the legendary, the lousy three, sorry, from this playthrough. But I might go do that later. But, Roto Roto, this is Kalpul. Do I have the pleasure of speaking with Master Wise Dragon? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, hello, Director. My, my. I certainly does a old heart good to be greeted with such a lively response. Now, if I could take a moment of your time, there is something we must discuss. You're about to be presented with an extraordinary, no exceptional opportunity. You know the Unova regions, Blueberry Academy, Unova confirmed. <laughs> I presume, yes. Of course, that that's where uh, Kiki and Carmen come from. Indeed, the tales of the school trip to Kitikami with the Blueberry cohorts reach my office. Uh, director of the Academy is an old friend of mine. He told me he was delighted to host you as an exchange student. Nice. So we're going to Unova. Nice. Uh, I want you to always take advantage of new challenges. I must confess, I am a bit surprised that Blueberry's director would specify you by name. Maybe Carmen and Kiki have uh, told him that I need to come. Uh, once you feel ready to respond to his offer, I ask that you come to my office. Okay, so we need to go to his office. There's nothing else that matters, except maybe healing up my Pokemon. So I'll go do that real quick. Just in case we have some battle or something like that at the very beginning. I think those are still from where we fought uh, Ogre Pond, I think. <laughs> or maybe Kiki. Kiki, I think. Which, at the end of the disc DLC, Kiki was starting to go a little, little crazy. So, I don't know for sure how to feel. Uh, oh, hey! Um, you're not Calvil, but okay. Uh, who do we have here? Okay, with the blue and everything like that, I'm guessing you're probably the director from the Academy, or you're someone from the Blueberry Academy. Either way. Who do we have here? I know. I've seen you somewhere before. Who are you? Where, where, where were you again? Um, yeah, I'm Wise Dragon. Oh, that's right. You're Wise Dragon. Yes, yes, I know you. Well then, now that we're here, let's get going. Wait just a moment, Director. Yep, he's the Director of Blueberry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sireno? Sireno? Hello there. Uh, always didn't realize you were here. Of course I'm here. As Director of the Academy, where else would I be? And do address me properly. Properly. Uh, more importantly, what are you doing here? Yeah, I thought we were going to the office, so. Did we? Must have slipped my mind. Anyway, what's the, what's the matter? This is a student, right? Well, yes, he is, but... I do apologize, Wise Dragon. You must be terribly confused. This is the director of Blueberry Academy. As I mentioned on the phone, he's interested in accepting you as an exchange student. Uh, one look at the young friend makes me suspect you indeed failed to clarify that moment. Okay, that point. Oh gosh, there's Drifloom in the background. Don't take the children. Uh, speaking of which, uh, request Wise or Wise Dragon specifically to take part in the exchange program. You are correct. Excellent question. The reason is... What's the reason? Why did I put in that request? Is it because of the certain children that came? Yes, a school trip. Yeah, he met some children from there, yes. Yes, one of them uh, was named Carmen. I believe she's the one who recommended you. What about Kiki? Did Kiki say anything, my sweet boy? I'm glad to hear that. Um, Just love for you to visit my school. Okay, I, I would be interested in seeing it. Get to know the students there. 
Yes, please. Think it's a chance to further expand upon your treasure hunt. Ah, oh, that treasure hunt again? I guess. Fine. If you really have to, like, uh, if you really have to make me. You will watch over him, won't you? Of course, of course. If any, I wouldn't let anything happen to one of your students. Uh, I hope this leads to even more you can treasure. Best of luck to you. Just give me a holler whenever you are ready to head to Blueberry. I do not trust this man. No, I'm kidding. I, I trust him. With every fiber of my being. Are you all ready to kick off your studies abroad? Oh. Apparently not. My controller does not want me to. Maybe it's a sign. I shouldn't go back to Unova. Yes, go. Let's get going then. My problem with Unova is, like, black and white, I, I did not... They are one of my least favorite regions. It it's not terrible, but it it's alright. I know there's been speculation that there's going to be, like, a, either a remake or a Legends game made with it, and I'm interested in that. Hidden Treasure of Area Zero. Part 2, the Indigo Disc. Nice, nice. Ooh, we got some music. Ta-da! We're here. Welcome to my Grand Blueberry Academy. Ooh, that's nice! I love the ocean. It's actually just the entrance. It's mostly underwater. Okay. Oh, did you notice? Look how blue this place is. Tell me how long I spent picking a perfect blueberry color. Uh, I'm guessing you probably took a lot longer. Perhaps we should have something you'd like to ask me. Uh, why do you pick blueberry? How do you know Cavill? Why is the school underwater? Yeah, that, that's a good question. Are you like a water-based school? That's what you're curious about? Well, it's very simple, you see. It's because the school building is attached to an undersea plant that develops natural resources. Oh! Yes, right, exactly. Took the words right out of my mouth. Uh, who are you? Always on point, aren't you? Lacey. Okay. Do we have a guest today? Yes, we do. Wise Dragon is here as part of the exchange program. This is the exchange student from Paldea. I suppose I didn't introduce myself, did I? I'm Lacey, one of the second year students here. You must really be something special, you know. We're gonna have to fight her. I already feel it. It's rare for the director to remember a name of a student. Go ahead, fight me. Come on. Do it, Lacey. You, you want me to do it. Well, yes, you know the tour guide stuff is in the, my strong suit. Well, that's true, but uh, I imagine there is someone more suitable to me. Carmen? Kiki, maybe? Please? Oh, don't take it like that. Uh, the director has a bad habit of pushing his duties onto me. Oh, he's that type of person. Okay. Really, let's, let me have it today, aren't you? That's right. This might be a chance to get to know a new student everyone talking about. I'll take the task. Are you not going to ask about why my clothes still look like they're from Kitakami? Because they're not coming off. These are staying on. <laughs> Let's head straight down the bridge. Kind of looks like a tentacruel. Ooh, okay. So we have gym battles here, it looks like. I love blue. Blue is my favorite color, so I, I would fit right in here at Blueberry. This is the entrance to the academy. Our school puts a great deal of emphasis on the art of Pokemon battling. We hold official matches in Central Court here. Any student can freely utilize this court. Oh, so I'm going to battle here. Exactly. Couldn't have said it better myself. I think perhaps it's fine if you just leave the tour to me. 
Uh, off often see students lazing in the stands. That'd be nice. Uh, and there's one other quality of the school you'll find it's very surprising. Wild Pokemon sometimes terrestrialize here. How is that possible? Really? What? Oh, I suppose it's nothing special to someone who's from Paldea. Exactly. I all already know about terrestrialization and terror orbs. We developed some neat tech ourselves. Control the terrestrial phenomenon on our own turf. Okay. Yeah, sure. It, that's kind of interesting. Do you guys have some of the terrestrialization crystals from Area Zero, I'm guessing? Uh, great if the two of you had a battle. Oh, I knew it! I knew it. We're going to battle. Uh, I'd like to see what Wise Dragon here is capable of. Uh, our Lacey is a member of the Elite Four in the League Club. Ooh! Okay, to say nothing of the influence of her father, one of the Unova's famed gym leaders. I bet you'll learn a thing or two. Oh, I wish you wouldn't spread the personal information without asking first. It's not right! Uh, give me a good show, you two. I'm sorry, but there's no negotiating with the director. Uh, no way he'll move on with the tour until you give him a battle. Oh, sh you're excited about me too? Fine, fine, we'll do this. Double battle? I'm fine with double battles. Can I? Oh, darn. I can't change my Pokemon around first. Okay, fine, we'll do it. I don't think it's quite fair to put me against an Elite Four member at the very beginning, but... Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Flamingo's gonna get wrecked by one of those puzzles of rhyme in. I suppose I'll represent Blueberry Academy. 70? 70? Really? Come on. <laughs> okay. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe we'll be fine. So, we have our low kick. We have grassy terrain. We have Ivy Crudel. Um. Let's use. What does this do again? Yeah, we'll go ahead and use that on Maimon, and then we will do our low kick on Plusle there. We'll see how much that does to them. That's half! That's half, okay. Oh, yeah, that that's what I was expecting. Oh, Lightning Rod. Okay. Interesting, interesting. Oh no! Oh no! They do it to each other! Oh, that's a good t that's a good that's a good match right there. And Ogre Pond is paralyzed now. Damn. I wouldn't even have known that they would have had that first. Okay, so let's put Sprig out there. Might as well. Okay. If you can use Ivy Crudel again. And you can use Flower Trick. I want to take out one of these. If I can just take out one of these guys. Then they won't be as powerful. That's quite the harsh blow. Uh, you don't say. You don't say. Swift? Okay. Oh, Ogre. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, one of them is down. The Puzzle Mime and Trio. Not Trio, sorry, a duo is done. Looks like my plus minus strategy. Okay. Ooh, Excadrill, really? Do we have to. Do we have to win this battle? I might have to level up some. Okay. Excadrill would be pretty easy for Sprig to take out. Should be, right? No! It has a bug type move. Are you serious? Okay, at least that was a crit. But now Sprig's done. 
Ah! This is an Elite Four member right here. And one I was not ready for. Okay. We'll bring out... I guess Dreadnaw. And then also Tinkaton. The problem is going to be Dreadnaw is not going to be the best to deal with um, Plusle there. But he does have Rock Tomb, okay? Rock Tomb would be actually pretty nice to use on. We'll do that, and then we will... We use... No, it's a Steel type, isn't it? Let's just do Gigaton Hammer. Let's see what the Gigaton Hammer does. Hopefully it kills Excadrill. What What is Excadrill doing? Ground. Oh my gosh. Okay, fine. 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 I hope we don't have to win this battle because I am wrecked. Her team is stacked. Did you see that? That is no fair. Which I mean, I I'm I'm just about her level, just about. Let's see if I can take out the extra drill before. Nope. Nope. Oh my. She is good. She is very good. I'm impressed. I'm impressed, I have to say. I think I heard someone say something about that battle being very hard in the very beginning, and I, I agree it was. I'm relieved I could pull out a win. It was a positively white-hot battle, after all. The students here at Blueberry were only issued Terra Orbs. Only recently issued. I, get, I don't know if I want to teach you about them. You're already this strong, okay? Maybe I should have used Terra Orb on here. Oh, they've been good. Speaking of style, I forgot I have a uniform for you. No, the Kitikami garb stays on, okay? I refuse. I guess I didn't refuse that much. <laughs> it looks like a little sailor's uniform. Kinda. It suits you beautifully. That's what I call fashion. Indigo style card. Nice. Ooh, okay, so I can buy new stuff. Okay. Now look at a part. Hopefully feel it too. Let's head to school. Okay, well let's go look around after being my getting my butt beat. Uh, our famous terrarium. Terrarium. Okay. Let's go look. Uh, that looks like the only place we can go. So let's go there. I th I've seen some pictures of this. I've seen some pictures of it, and it's like mind blowing. <laughs> well, I mean, not mind blowing to me, they're not the right words, but it looks beautiful. Ooh. Ah. Okay, so this is like a plains uh, savanna area kind of thing. I'd say savanna. How big are these region areas? That's one thing I don't know. This is it. The park beneath the sea that has gained renown around the world. The Terrarium. We may be underwater, but the projections built into the walls and ceiling make it feel like we're actually outside. Yeah, it does look that. Yeah. I designed it all myself. Believe me, it wasn't cheap. How did you pay for this, really? There are four distinct biomes. So, subtropical tropical savanna, yes. Uh, breezy tropical coastal biome. Mountainy, craggy, ca canyon biome, yes. Ooh, ice and snow. Okay, arctic snowy polar biome. Each biome has an air temperature and humidity levels are regulated with the utmost care. How do you have... How do you keep them separated? Uh, find completely different Pokemon species in each area. Put a lot of effort into it. 
Tell me, Wise Dragon, which biome tickles your fancy off the bat? I like the tropical coastal biome. Goodness, really? Seems you and I may get along just great then. That's my favorite, too. Uh, I need to heal up your team while you're down there. Self serve healing machines? That is one thing we've been needing for a while, right there. Now then, Director, can you explain to us why a crystal form here? And how wild Pokemon are able to terrestrialize? Uh, I, I don't, but don't you know already, Lacey? In that case, let me show you. The reason is actually right above our heads. Is that a big translation? Oh, no, it's a core. Uh, it presides over all that happens in here. It contains a fluid jam-packed full of special material from Paldea. It constantly emits translation energy. Okay, cool. I don't know what type of liquid is in there. What type of material? Yeah, I don't know what the special material is. Is it shared publicly? Hmm? Oh, you want to know? Well, the fact is, it's... You're not going to tell me, are you? Or you don't know. Oh, you... No, you did not forget. Blair put it all together, so I'm not certain myself. Ah, that's what I thought you might say. Practical battle class will commence shortly in the coastal biome. Students participating, oh, participating in this class should make their way to the coastal biome now. That sounds like us. Classes in session, boys and girls. This is too good. Oh, too good a chance to pass up. Won't you join us? Yeah, I'll join you. This could be pretty cool. Oh, nice uh, Rotom phone. It's fun to take a stroll through the terrarium. Uh, holding hands. Oh. Please find your way to the class site in the coastal biome on your own. Wait, sir, you don't. Uh, I'm sure the dorm rooms have been all set up for you, Wise Dragon, so don't forget to give it a visit later. Oh, yes, one other thing. Could you open your Pokedex wrap for me? Are you going to update it so I can have more Pokemon now, please? Yes, Blueberry. Catch as many Pokemon here as you can, please. Don't be afraid to go saw bucks wild. It's your student life here at Blueberry, so remember to live it to your fullest. And there he goes. Well, you can at least count on me to be around when you need me. It's probably time we both head to class. Yeah, I heard that all the battles here are a lot higher stake. Like, not higher stakes, but like harder. Much harder. So I might actually have to tweak my team. Like, change up my team a little bit. Because I've been kind of getting lucky on things. Kind of like the Ogre Pond battle. I was very, very close to losing. But this place is huge. Uh, do we need to heal? No, we don't need to heal. Okay. We have... Oh, hey, they got vending machines for all our materials and stuff like that. Like, Pokeballs and stuff. We already have... Ex oh, Chansey! Execute. Nice. Oh! Dugtrio? Not Dugtrio. Um, what are they called? Dotrio. Dotrio. So far, I'm liking it. I like all the new Pokemon and stuff. Well, not new Pokemon, but... Returning Pokemon, returning Pokemon. So yeah, I will probably end this off here, and then we will go look around the coastal area next, because that's where we're going to have our practical battles. But I might have to level up Pokemon a little bit. I don't know. I might do that later. So yeah, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed a first look here at Blueberry Academy. We'll continue on and next time, and... Yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the DLC if you guys haven't. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. So, bye!